everyone. Welcome to another episode of Judge a Book by its Cover. So this is where BPL staff judges a book purely on the cover of the book without knowing anything else about it. Yes. So, yes, very entertaining. Um, my name is Melissa Macumber and I'm the Technical Services Coordinator and uh, I do what's called acquisitions in the library world where I order books and pay bills. And I'm Katie. I'm one of the assistants. I work in a lot of different areas, um, but one of the fun things I get to do is unbox all the new books that come in, so that's the best. Yes, that is very fun. Yes. See the new exciting things. Yes. All right, so okay. are, we, are we ready? Yep. You want me to go first? Sure. All right, I'm going to choose... The pink one. The pink book. All right. <laughs> So this is called Something Unbelievable, Ooh. and it's by Maria Kaznutsova. Ooh. So this is a new book that just came out in July. And um, so I'm going to judge this purely on the cover. So I think I would check this one out because it's got this mountain and a train on the front. So it looks like it might be in somewhere, maybe similar climate to where we live here. So I'm going to say maybe it's a Pacific Northwest book. And um, I love trains. Trains are like my favorite. So my husband proposed to me on a train. And so I like trains. And this looks like a pleasant book because it's got like the pink and it the does. red. Um, it looks kind of whimsical. Yes, a little yeah. whimsical. And um, it looks like a calming book. It doesn't look like it has too much drama. Not I heavy. mean, the train doesn't look like it's about to crash or anything like that. So I'm going to say this is about a train ride that these people go on. And um, they go to explore. And um, maybe somebody proposes. Yeah. Well, it does. It's actually like a diamond necklace or something oh, it is. so maybe there's a little bit of a mystery on the train i'm going to say they're on this train and maybe someone's maybe someone's diamonds got stolen or something oh, nice. and so they had to so you know sort of like an agatha christie yeah. sort of fun like Light mystery on mystery. the train but it all turns out good so um but it's unbelievable whatever happens <laughs> but it, it turns out well but it's really unbelievable how these maybe the way the diamonds are stolen is unbelievable so we're gonna go Very with good. that's that's why I would so read that book I'm gonna I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with that and you I can find this in the new fiction right inside the library yeah so all right right on your turn Katie okay Ooh. The Removed. It looks very colorful. By Brandon Hobson. It looks colorful at first glance, but I think it's not a happy book. Because it also has darkness. It does. Are they upside down? They're upside down in like a puddle. That's not good. That's not good. A National Book Award finalist. Where the Dead Sit Talking. Okay. Mm -hmm. This is about a young man who gets lost in the woods and he's trying to have a coming of age moment mm. it's not working <laughs> <laughs> that's the upside that's, downness that's the upside downness <laughs> this is uh i don't know yeah I, th I think you're right on i think it it could also be kind of a thriller Ooh. Like, I don't know, he meets something strange in the world. Maybe it's like a hidden science fiction uh, story. It's like, okay. It's yeah. a coming undercover age science, science fiction. fiction. Oh, yes. Very yes. interesting. But I'm prone to believe that it all ends up well in the end because it is a bit colorful. So... Maybe he finds. So it all works out. It all works out. After the. Or maybe it doesn't. Maybe it's a cliffhanger. <laughs> well, you're supposed to choose. I think it's a cliffhanger. <laughs> I think there's going to be a sequel. Oh. So definitely read this one. The Removed Again. The Removed Again. <laughs> <laughs> the Removed Again. So there's a good conclusion, but yeah, they leave it some. It leaves you hanging um, if you want untied more. Untied up threads. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's good to have in a book. Yeah. Keep you on so, the edge of your seat. You know, I at first glance I wasn't gonna check this one out, but now I think I might. I talked myself might. into it. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm gonna let you read it first. Okay. 
Very I good. want to see how the sci-fi turns out. Yeah. Yeah. Like the the gravity, maybe gravity messes up yeah, or there's something. Something. Yeah. Some okay. supernatural. Elements. Those are our reviews. All right. Those are our books. And uh, if you liked our reviews, then you should check these out. If you didn't, you should check them out and do your own review. But comment yes. in the comment section. And, and let us know how we did. Yes, please do. We would love to hear from you. Yes. And uh, we're going to go do some reading. We'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs>